No fixed date for the return of major cruise ships to Grenada's ports. However, preparations are ongoing for the arrival of smaller cruise ships later this year. That's according to Manager of Product Development and Research at the Grenada Tourism Authority, Carl Hashtiolik. Well, I think I have a short answer for that one. I know what we have, we are expecting some smaller ships later on this year. That to be confirmed in more details a little bit later on as well. There have been a number of conversations up to yesterday with regard to, you know, different proposals, what needs to be done on both ends, be it it's through um, our Miami connections or, or be it, you know, the, the, the actual cruise lines are actually coming through from Europe. Um, but the actual protocols for, for, for us to be able to ex execute those on the ground, those are being currently being fine-tuned and developed on this end with the relevant parties. So Hoshtialik adds that the tourism sector cannot stand alone, as many sectors are hinged on tourism. A number of protocols have been developed, as well as training of staff in a number of areas. There is need, she says, to open up at this time. Some of the bigger hotels will reopen their doors, some within the next month, while others, such as Spice Island Beach Resort, will remain closed until 2021. With the gradual opening up of the tourism industry, there are concerns about the safety of citizens and the quarantine protocols for foreign guests. With regard to the um, quarantine for, for, for visitors, um, the Ministry of Health will be taking the lead on that. Um, should the visitors, um, people who are actually coming into the country, be it as visitors, uh, you know, um, residents, um, or the like, um, you know, the Ministry of Health will be taking the lead with regard to quarantine and where they will be quarantined. During their staff with the training, um, ensuring that their properties are also prepared with the decals, the social distancing and the signage, um, ensuring that their staff understands how to go about the communication, how to go about the cleaning, disinfecting, sanitizing. All of these now have become um, the new normal for them. And they have put um, a lot of emphasis and effort into ensuring that their properties are ready. She speaks on the plans going forward for the industry. Okay, so part of the rollout for um for reopening was a pure safe travels approved stamp that the Grenada Tourism Authority um, would have developed, which identifies um, properties and businesses that are COVID smart and ready. Right, um, we have introduced that stamp, so you will actually see them in different places. Uh, tourism tourism places across the country in Grenada, Caribou, and Petit Martinique. Um, but of course, there are other levels of that as well. Uh, so within the protocols, we speak to to what needs to happen. But in terms of the pure safe travel stamp, that is almost like a promotional tool for us. We have also been endorsed by the World Travel and Tourism Council with their um, safe travel stamp as well. And that is also recognized globally. And so those two things really go hand in hand in terms of what happens next. Chris Lina John, GBN News.